Let's go on, Karen. <laughs> okay, Urban Outfitters started right here in Philadelphia. Absolutely under fire. Now, would you be so depressed on the most depressing day of the year that you would don a shirt that actually just blurts it out? Most depression. And a belly shirt, which makes it even better. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, there's controversy over this woman's T-shirt with the word depression on it. Urban Outfitters pulled the shirt from its stores and website after shoppers complained the shirt was making light of a serious disease. Oh, that's true. The shirt was actually made by a company whose name is Depression. Now, I will have to tell you, when I did a depression joke to start the 7 o'clock, I got a couple of tweets from people who says nothing to laugh about. Right, and why they were depressed, and then you feel bad when you hear why they're depressed. A lot of people have, you know, serious things going on. And a lot of you have tweeted us this morning, you agree, and even as far as this shirt is concerned, people are tweeting that the shirt is distasteful. One person tweeted, quote, absolutely disgusting what Urban, Outfitter, Urban Outfitters is selling. Disgraceful. I don't know how that is allowed. Another tweeted, this is vile. Does Urban Outfitters not know how offensive and triggering these tops are? Urban Outfitters, of course, a Philly-based company, which is why this grabbed our attention. Wasn't it a Penn grad who started Urban Outfitters, I think? Lives out there in Chester County. Yeah. I think that every other week we do a store on Urban Outfitters. I think we had a Hindu sock that was uh, that. offending people. That was, I think, a week or two ago. So they pushed the time you and know. again. I mean, it's yeah. part of what they do. So they're edgy, and when you're playing the edge, sometimes you're going to step over the line, and they frequently do it, and then they have to backtrack. I, I don't want to defend the shirt, but I think one of the things that was interesting about it is when you read it, it said depression, but you also saw expression mm -hmm. across a lot of oh. it. So I'm, I'm sure there's a lot of different, you know, artistic, you know, play on words kind of things going on, but I think it's not a funny thing to so many people that you better you err on Agreed. the side of not doing it. So I adjusted my uh, comedy writing here and got rid of all the depression jokes. <laughs> yeah. and, Instead, uh, we get nacho cheese left. jokes. Yeah, nacho cheese. <laughs> hey, rumors are circulating.